Oh no, oh no. Or keeping you busy? Oh yeah, I have a, I have, I have, twenty page essay that I have to write for tomorrow. Um, yeah, five thousand words on the contributing role of the ancient regime in the French Revolution. I mean, there's there's no way. How does how does one write a twenty page paper in one night? I, I I'm gonna fail. I'm gonna fail. Well, I think all that coffee's a good start. Mm -hmm. You should mm -hmm. be fine. Just have another cup. Or you will fail. Well, Colin totally bailed out on me, all right? Shocker. Conflective schedule well, or something. Did you call Jermaine, like I asked you? Yeah, I mean, but he's, he's booked up for months. Well, yeah, he's a good videographer. Well, this. Th that's what I hear, but he's booked. He's, look, you know what? It's gonna, there's going to be free food. My mother will pay you. I told her I was going to get the best in the business. You know all right? Okay, okay. I will do it for you as a wedding present, okay? As a friend, not as a professional <laughs> Thank arrangement. Thank you. What are you a videographer for weddings? No, now? see, that's what I want to avoid <laughs> right there. That's the kind of rep I don't want. By the way, I, by the way, I found a date for your wedding. Oh, it's just mm -hmm. a wedding party, but cool. Oh yeah, whatever. That's cool. Whatever. It's Anwar. What, the guy you met on Friday yes, night? the guy I met on Friday night. You barely know him. Whatever. You're going to bring him to the... guy. We'll have a great time. He could cool. be an axe great. murderer. Anyway, listen, you guys. I wanted to run this by you, okay? You know the situation that's going on at my workplace? Well, it's closing now, okay? Yeah. So a bunch of us got together and decided we're going to buy out the place next door or rent it out or whatever and open a man spa. A spa exclusively for men. About time. You mean like? Right? Right? You mean like? Yeah. Of course. A gay right. man spa? No, not gay man. Just any man. Why? I can't. I can't read anymore. My eyes are. Oh, jumping all over. Jumping. Yeah. Just my. Just I've been fighting this um, headache. Oh. Behind my headache, eyes huh? all day, and I can't even like. I don't know if I should take anything. Oh, I mean, I what the heck is this? Oh. What was your lunch? <laughs> That's um, a stress ball. Oh, really? It's freezer. That's yeah. cute. I mean, my doctors told me that I need to uh, cut the stress for the sake of the baby, you know, just oh, to kind of... Oh, yeah. Chill. Yeah. Nine but, new messages already. Like, oh, I, my gosh. Uh, popular. You think you're stressed now? Wait till that baby comes. Then you'll see stress. Yeah. <laughs> you'll need ten of these. <laughs> <laughs> you're right. Um, <laughs> Okay, I'm I'm just gonna breathe. Yeah. Oh, breathing's good. Breathing's good. We should Maybe do it all the time. Do some yoga. <laughs> <laughs> oh yoga, yeah. Maybe a crossword. <laughs> yeah. No, this'll stress you out. <laughs> What's a three letter word for stress? <laughs> Liz. <laughs> <laughs> I used to sneak into salons like, really early in the morning because they were ashamed and when guilty. When I was in Los Angeles, As okay. Well, should be. Oh my gosh. When I was in LA, they had a great spa. Okay, we used to do business yeah. there. It was really masculine. I mean, it had big leather couches, you know, sports on the television. Sure, hot, sure. No matter hot. how you dress room it up, guys aren't going to go to a spa. Yeah. Bottom, line. Bottom line. Bottom line. Maybe not in Burlington, in New York, Los Angeles. We're not in New York. Yeah, we're in yes. Toronto. We got to start thinking more cosmopolitan around here. Zach, okay? you are not going to maintain these boyish looks forever. You do know that, right? Yeah. You're gonna start so? having hair growing out of places, out your ear, out your yeah. nose, crawling you got some, your neck. You got some big ass, big hairs coming out your nose Who's right now. Who's gonna take care of your calluses and all that? Hair. Look, I, I don't care. All right, whatever. Hair. Uh, your wife will care. Right. She will care, and you'll want to please her, Zach. Mm -hmm. It's obvious uh -huh. that you are a true non-believer. That's right. So I'm gonna try and change your mind. Well, you don't go to the spa, the spa's gonna come to you. you What's go. that? I just have a few sample items in here. It'll be really like quick what? and easy. Like things that you'll enjoy, trust me. Have you ever oh, seen yeah, Marathon yeah, Man? Like uh -huh. Dustin Hoffman. Remember the dentist? Yes. But you did graduate high school, right? So you've written, a, you've written an essay before, correct? Yes, I have. Okay, so if you've written an essay before, you know that you need time to write them. You've been procrastinating, dear. That's your problem. You have been sitting on your... 
No, I have not. Okay, the reason that I am behind is because I just got back from spending a month in Indonesia, and it was a physically and emotionally exhausting month looking for my brother. And is it my fault that I had the unfortunate luck of ending up with a tight ass prof who will not give me another extension, or that the recommended reading material is so dense that okay. I have to read hey, each hey. page three times Dana, because I Dana, don't understand? Dana, don't relax. Cry, don't look, cry. Look, don't cry. It's, look, it's fine. Yeah, you don't need to cry. Here's a little tip I, I use in university, okay? It's really simple. It's an acronym. Okay, ROPE, R-O-P-E, R, research, get your research done, O, make an outline from that research, P, put it in point form, and E, exposition. You tie it all together, and you've got your essay. No, because I don't have, I don't have time. Okay, if you use that crazy system, you will be a D-O-P-E, okay? What you need to do is you need to get online, and you need to buy, buy one. <laughs> yeah, right, that'll work. Sure. Well, People do it all the time. Is it expensive? I can't believe you're seriously considering taking this guy's advice. What? I mean, think about it. Okay, look. Yeah, buying an essay online, all you're doing is cheating the system, and you're cheating the student. I mean, the student loses out on an opportunity the to system, educate themselves. The system, sir, is going to screw you for your whole life. So every once in a while, you need to crawl on top of the system and <laughs> give, give it a, a good hard You're slap. You're there for an education. If you don't do the work and you do it, you take the easy way out, how do you learn anything but cheaters okay, prosper? Okay, look, Mr. Cotter, just slow down a second, okay? The reality of it is is that she needs to do this by tomorrow. There's no way you're gonna do it by tomorrow. Are you a genius You in the Mensa Club? No, you're not gonna be able to do it. It's friggin' French Revolution. But then what are you learning? What are you taking away from it then? What are you learning? You're taking this course to learn things. What are you learning? Uh -huh. Mary Antoinette cut people's heads off, let them eat cake. There was a revolution in France. Now it's a republic. They don't have a king. Blood and uh, blah, blah, yeah, blah. Yeah, didn't they cut her head off at the same time? I don't know. I don't know. I don't. I don't know. That's the problem. I don't know. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Yes, it does. Doesn't matter. Yes, it does. Doesn't matter. Don't listen to him. Doesn't matter. He's the funniest man in the world. Bottom line. Yeah. What and the bottom stuff? line anyway, is. It's cuticle. It's just gonna loosen up your cuticles so I can push them back. That Conan O'Brien is American, okay? And he's walking in here like the entertainment messiah. He's okay? funny. He's funny. Yes, that's great. What about our own native talent, okay? What's wrong? He's got our with talent Canadian? on his show. He's got exactly. Like, and they're not like lining who? up around the block at Queen oh. and John to see him, are they? Like oh, Adam a Sandler. Girls are. Did you see all the people that were I on know. Adam music Sandler is Canadian. Canadian talent, okay, and the Canadian talent he does have on, like Stompin' Tom Connors, is just perpetuating the Canadian stereotype Mike Myers. that the Americans Ow, like wow, to see. What are you doing? Just, I'm just pushing back the cuticle. Now there's some nails, okay? Don't Trust me, it'll make your nail look Listen, a lot better. Conan O'Brien, okay, is Ow. with his with his arrogance, is coming in here thinking that he's doing Ow. us a favor, okay? Look, we've got a great city here. The man we've went got to Harvard. Great talent. All right. Ooh, he went cares. to Harvard. He went to Harvard. He wrote for The Simpsons for like three years. Oh, He's come brilliant. On. He looks so like a Simpson. So Have you seen his head? It's so huge. we just he roll out the red carpet for him and go, oh Conan, oh Conan. When Ow. we got great late night talent Ow. right here in Canada, Ow. I tell you, this is manifest destiny, nothing else. Oh, you're manifest blowing it out of proportion. Look, does it look better already? Oh, it doesn't feel better. Don't worry. Would you just submit, surrender, Dorothy? To what, this this wooden thing being shoved under my nail? Trust me, it's healthy. It's good for you. Once the redness goes away. Am I bleeding? No, you're not bleeding. <sighs> Unbelievable. Ah, okay. There's this new uh, director of global sales at my company. The longest messages, oh. like rambling. This is like message three. Some people. He's taking credit for all my work. He's unbe. Oh, oh, oh! oh. I don't, I don't oh, even know how to deal with him anymore. Like seriously, delete him. He thinks because I went to New York, there's some kind of loyalty issue, and he's got to keep things from me. Oh, my, my contractor. Oh, at your house. My kitchen. Breathing. They had to turn the heat off in my house, so one of the pipes has frozen and burst all over my kitchen. Oh. Which, you know, on top of everything, the marble counter that's cracked was delivered cracked. The sub-zero 
fridge that won't fit in the slot they left it. Oh, the no. the wine bar that's too tall for the stools that I bought. I I I don't even. I kind of. I, you know, you, you just don't even know how to deal with this stuff when it all piles on top. I'm, I'm cooking dinner on a George Foreman stove in my oh, living room. I like those little yeah. grills. No, they are, they are good, but, but uh, well, get okay, clearly the breathing is not, um, the breathing's not really, uh, it's not really working. Squeeze your arm. Yeah. Do you think you're the only person to ever think about getting an essay online? and submitting it as your own work. Let me tell you a story about my friend Herb. Herb was very, very talented, but extremely lazy. And for whatever reason, he didn't have enough time to study for the final exam. So what did he do? He got a copy of it somehow, and he used it to cheat, right? But he got caught because his answers were letter perfect. So not only did he have to suffer the humiliation of getting expelled, having to explain to his parents why he didn't graduate. He now is a mass murderer. Close. Close. He's an assistant manager at a Radio Shack, but he got a black mark on his transcript, which prevented him from going to any other decent school. Is it worth the risk, really? You know, the reason he got caught is because he was a dumb cheater. There's smart cheaters and dumb cheaters. He's a dumb cheater. You're not a dumb cheater. I know that. No, but it's true. I, I mean, I, I, I was the one to make the choice, to make the commitment, to, to see this university thing through, you know? And, and it's true, I would be letting everybody down, be letting myself down, right? What is this uh, commercial for the Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints? Leave it alone. It's one course, for God's sake. It's no problem. I, I just don't get it. This a British huh? rap band. Yeah, they're okay. based out of London. <clears throat> that they're supporters of Osama yeah. bin Laden. They're huge Al Qaeda supporters. So they but put out this rap called "Dirty Infidels." Yeah, yeah. It's, it's violent. On the internet. It's, it's totally. not only violent. I mean, it's hate. Yeah. yeah. I mean, Al Qaeda well, I thought hates. We were done. No, I'm just gonna do your eyebrows really quick. Don't mm -hmm. worry. The Al Qaeda hates other races. Okay, they yeah. hate other nations, not uh, you know above and beyond America. Mm -hmm. And you're and you're actually listening to these guys. Well, no, I mean I don't, I don't listen to it. I don't support it or anything like that. But you have to admit, send the message through the music. They want to get young Muslims to wage a holy war. So do it through. What? They want young Muslims, Muslims, Muslims to go and strap, what, yeah, strap bombs strap to themselves. A bomb exactly. on myself. Actually, yeah, into that's what the they want. Market so. square. Like, Ow! On. Hey, sorry. Ow! Dude, what are you just, doing? I'm just trying to get rid of your unibrow, the yeah. caterpillar crawling up. That's got to go right? if I'm going to direct your little wedding video, by the way. Okay. And what about your little caterpillar? No, he, he wears it well. He's got yeah. like a Wolverine look going on. Well, just so tell, teach Jack me how to wear it well. <laughs> no, 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 no. You're gonna need it. No, 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 no. Just relax. No. Just relax, no. man. Okay. It'll be okay. Ow. Just one at a time. Okay. Just anyway. Just one. So uh, yeah, it's all over the internet, and there's a video that goes with it as it's well. It's a stupid video. Well, it's like well, news I don't footage. Get, wait, Ow! Saw this video. Just come on. Chin up. Chin up. on the news. Chin up. Stop. No, the this is good for you. It it's hurts. good for you. It'll hurt for a second. Hey, it's ow, it's called down. freedom of speech. <laughs> I mean, I'm not saying that it's... Yeah, that Aaron Sundle right. has freedom of speech, too. And, look, you know, come on. Well, he doesn't like the, anymore. Well, exactly. There's ow. a fine line between okay, freedom okay, of speech and Okay, that's enough. I'm bleeding. No, you're no, not. that's not no, enough. I bleed the, really easily. Yeah, but you're not. Just uh, one exactly. more. This baby has got to... Ow! Yeah. Okay, that's There you go. There you go. Let me see. Okay, now, your massaging hurts more than the plucking. If your eyes are watering, just kind of let me... Blink it away. There you go. No, I'm not. Spa's hurt. My friend in university, Tyler, now works for a major corporation, makes $250,000 a year around. You know what he did? Every time he needed a paper, he bought one, okay? Now, he was, a, he was brilliant in business, okay? But when it came to these useless electives that mean nothing to you later on in life, he would just buy them. And you know what he did? He was very smart. He never bought an A paper, an A minus. He would only buy B plus or below. Because you see, TAs and profs, they know all about those, right? They've seen them a million times. You could totally get away with it. See, that's exactly the kind of thinking that gets all these corporations in a lot of trouble, like Enron, right? Like, like the financial situation of Ontario right now, where we're running like 5.6 billion in no. debt. Right what gets now. people in it's trouble is, is money. 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 Money is what gets people money. in it's trouble. It's cheating their way out of a system where they know they're in trouble. Like, look at you, all right? You took a month off of school to do something very noble, granted, but did you honestly think there wasn't going to be any consequences? 
I mean, you have to face up to that. Okay, and cheating but look, around she that doesn't have to help. You don't have to face up to, look, okay. Ask me, how many essays has I written since I graduated from university? Uh, uh, zero, okay? I have written zero. You do not need to know about this crap. And even, you know how to write, okay? You're smart, you know how to like write and type and all that stuff. So don't worry about it. French Revolution, who gives a crap? It's true, I mean, how, 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 how is an essay on the French Revolution gonna help me get, what, get a record deal? It's not right? necessarily about the subject matter. It's the work that you put into it that really matters. Mm -hmm. Oh, water damage, what a nightmare. Mm -hmm. There are new floors and new baseboards, and I've got files in there and cardboard boxes, and, and it's an old house. It's just, it's just a nightmare of structural damage. Oh, hey, I know nightmares. <laughs> I'm still getting a runaround about Doug's insurance uh, oh, settlement. God. And Daniel, he just got his license. So what does he want? A car. I said, I can't give you a car right now, can't afford it. And little Lukey, yeah. I saw him, he was on the internet looking at pornography. <laughs> oh. Yeah, he, he cracked through that kid's block I had oh set up. Oh my gosh. Oh, and Caitlin, oh, this poor little thing. I called her before I left work. She'd spilt the lasagna. She was supposed to put it in the oven. Oh, and well, you have an it. oven. Well, <laughs> anyways, they're gonna have to wait till I get home and then we'll have pizza, you well, know? So how do you stay all calm then? You're not all stressed out. You don't even need this squeezy thing. I rely on my faith, Liz. My faith in God. It, it allows me not to worry about what I can't control. I mean, what about your guy, Don Cherry, right? Whoa. What about him? They should have censored his big mouth a long oh, time ago. Oh, don't even bring Don Cherry in with Ernst Zundel and Osama bin Laden and these yahoos rapping about Al Qaeda. Does it yeah, but smell like this? It, yeah, it's uh, ylang ylang. It's good stuff, trust me. Jeez, head up. Yeah, I but do you remember what he said? Yeah, yeah. He said what that Europeans say? and French Canadians, because they wear visors, are wusses. They're, and they're wusses and they're more prone to high sticking. He was making you a point. You can't say that. You, somebody got offended, okay? Hey, somebody got the offended. The facts are the facts. I mean, look at the Toronto Maple Leafs. Nick Anthropov, okay, wearing a visor, is leading the league in high, uh, the, in high it's sticks. Irrelevant. Relevant. You can't talk about a cultural group like that. It's about time it's celebrities take responsibility oh, for it's doing hockey. wrong. Number one, it's Don Cherry, okay? Oh, because it's Don Cherry. It's okay. Tell that to Diana Ross, who is spending oh two days God. in jail. And I'm, two good. days? Yeah, she had a drunk it's driving nothing. charge some couple years ago or whatever. Yeah. She's going to jail, and that's good. She could have taken a life, right? Yeah. <sighs> kind of tingles, I. Yeah, do you like that? Yeah. Yeah, that's the best part. Really, it, even if you don't have power uh, or faith in, in a higher power, you gotta have faith in yourself at the very least. Yeah. Well, no, think about it. Of, of all the things you've, you've persevered through. I mean, look, haven't we all, just when you think it's, it's the darkest, and believe me, you know, we're always faced with challenges, and you go, you know what? I just have to look forward and I'll get through it. And we do. I mean, you've survived two marriages, two marriages, and a miscarriage. And you, you, you've worked to be a successful woman. You're a smart woman. You little tiled floors and a broken pipe. Pshaw. Huh? Yeah. Hey? Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. Yeah, I you just could get see. through it. I, I, know. I know. Overwhelming. Nothing. Not for Liz Gallo Irwin. Erwin Gallo. My mistake. Can I use the orange? Yes. Thanks, Brenda. <laughs> Tickles my hand. <laughs> na, 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 There it is, the pure, unadulterated state of mellowosity. There it is. Ah! Oh! There you go. Now it's gone. See the difference? See? Stress, relaxation. Stress, relaxation. Stress, relaxation. Okay, okay, you know what? The, the, it the, works. The scalp she thing, it's, genius. It's, it's nice, but the, genius. the poking and the plucking and the scaring is all very okay, well, uncomfortable. No, but the, the scaring is not part into. of it. The scaring, leave that part out. Stuff. Since you like the head massage, how about a full hair and scalp treatment? My, my gift to you, wedding gift. Huh? Complete body wrap and massage, pedicure, get rid of those calluses. Uh, I, you, you know what? I just I, I don't think I can do the spa thing. I'm sorry. Thank you. Well, what? You know, I just can't. It's she just spot. offered you a gift, and you're denying her the gift. 
Well, I just, well, well, what? What's sitting on the fence? Okay, you're gonna sit on the fence? I withdraw my gift then. What? No more videography for you. No, 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 no. You can't. No, you can't do that. Oh, I, I sure can. You. No, you're you're being okay. ungrateful. Quite okay. obviously, you know that's fine. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Scalp business and wraps and sure. Are you still in? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> can I get one of those? No. Just the <laughs> hand massage. No. Please. This whole situation, it's its completely unfair. It's not like, it's not like I asked for my brother to go missing. Mm -hmm. All right, and what about my poor parents? If I fail, you know what, that's, that's gonna They'll be They'll so, be heartbroken. It's gonna be so stressful for them. Exactly. All right, and, and they've already been so bent out of shape with what happened with Nigel in Indonesia that they don't need that added of stress right now. you've made up your mind, okay? Your mind's made up, it's fine. And I'll I'm... just do it this once. It's not like I'm gonna keep doing it. You yeah. know, I'll do it once, just to get once. myself back on track. Just so you're back on me. track, you know that's what? Right. The road to the dark side is often a steep and slippery slope. Okay, slow down, Darth Vader. Leave her alone. It wasn't Darth Vader, it was Yoda. And what I'm saying is true, okay? Dana, you always struck me as a person with integrity, who held your principles up high. You sacrifice those principles and your integrity this one time, it just becomes easier the more and more you do it. Sooner or later, you become the people that you hate. Okay. You know, your integrity is not going to be worth anything if you're flipping burgers at a fast food joint, okay? You don't have a choice unless you are super humanly intelligent like this guy over here and you can sit down and write this whole thing in one night, you're screwed. So, you have to cheat. <laughs>